Welcome back to a new video. Today we're going to make message bottles. Little bottles that you can get at the Dollar Tree. And depending on how many bottles you get and what size they are, they're $1.25 for, I think you get five or six of this size. Five of these, I think. You get five or six of this size. And I think you get four or five of this size. You can also get them at Hobby Lobby, you can get them at Michael's, you can get them at Joann's. I'm not sure how much they are there because I get mine at the Dollar Tree. But we're going to put letters on them. If you're skilled with a paintbrush, you can paint the letters on. I'm not that skilled with a paintbrush because if you can all tell by my videos, I shake a lot. Um, I have nerve problems and I have diabetes. And when my sugar is too high or too low, I shake a lot, as if you can tell in some of my videos. I shake. Anyways, I don't have a very steady hand, so I, I choose the lettering. You know, sticker, letter stickers you get. You can pick them up anywhere, any of the craft stores, online, Walmart, Kmart, Target. Is Kmart a thing anymore? I don't know. Might not be. It's not in my area. I haven't seen a Kmart in probably six or seven years, so I don't know if it is or not. But I know they have them at Target, they have them at Walmart. Um... You can pick them up just anywhere, online, wherever, um, and you can put them on these little bottles. This one here says love. Um, in the bottles, you can put anything. For instance, this bottle here, let me get it close up. This bottle here contains drills, spare drills I had left over from diamond painting. This one here contains um, gl uh, red glitter. This one here contains... Um, Himalayan pink salt that you cook with. This one here contains iridescent uh, silver glitter, like chunky style glitter. And they're setting on um, a uh, popsicle stick that I painted red. And you can, if you want, and I do suggest this, super glue the corks in there after you get your little items you want inside the jars. That way if it falls over or falls off, the uh, shelf is on, they will not, these items will not spill out all over the place because that's going to be a pain in the butt to pick up. You can put anything at all in these bottles. If they will fit into the neck of the bottle, you can put it in. Rice, sand, sequins, seed beads, glitter, uh, mica powder, um, little tiny resin pieces. I mean, it is endless. You can put bits of foil in them. You can put... Um, I mean, if it'll fit in the neck of the bottle, you can stick it in. Flowers, dried flowers, anything. So, um, this one is already done. I did this a little while ago. And we're going to do ones. We're going to do um, four today, four more. One that says faith, one that says hope, one that says peace, and one that says joy. And we're going to do them in four different sizes. We're going to do ones that are this small. That's going to be our joy ones. We're going to do the next size up, which is this one. This is going to be our faith. No, this is, this is either going to be faith or peace. Then this one here is the next size up. We're going to do this. This is either going to be faith or peace, whichever the other one's not. And then this one here is a little short, fat one. And we're going to do this one. It's going to say hope. So. I guess we just pull you down on the desktop here and get filling the jars and putting the letters on them and get them all done up. We'll put you down here and go through the items you'll need and we'll get to it. Okay. I have some sequins here. I have some of these tiny little itty bitty roses that are made of metal. I have some glitters fine glitters and chunky glitters. I have some strips of deco mesh foil. Deco mesh foil um, by iCraft. Um, I cut them into strips and I'm going to just shove them down in the bottles and let the uh, foil shine through. Um, I have already gotten these three little bottles filled with stuff 
because they were a real pain in the bucket to do. So I went ahead and did them off camera. The other ones I'm going to fill up on camera. I got some little containers over here full of sand. The sand is still wet and damp because I colored it with my alcohol shimmer mist, which on the channel later on I will show you how to make your own DIY shimmer mist. And you can color your own sand and do other things, wonderful things with it. I have some shaker bits here, little bitty shaker bits that I can fit in these wider mouth jars. Um, I have be going out, it will be coming out on the channel how to make these shaker bits, these resin, UV resin shaker bits for your shaker cards. And they're also going to be using them here on uh, the channel here for the shaker or for the, the little message bottles. Tweezers are good. You're going to need some tongue depressors and some popsicle sticks. They can be colored, they can be plain, you can paint them, you can marker them up or whatever you want to do with them, leave them plain. I, I made a little makeshift uh, funnel to get into the bottles a little easier. So you might want to make a makeshift uh, funnel if you don't have a plastic one. I have some seed beads and I have some, I think these are called bugle beads, I believe, these little um, like barrel shaped ones. I think they're called bugle beads, I could be wrong. And I have my butter stickers and a pair of scissors. And we may need the glue gun later. Um, I don't know. We might not. But it's on standby. Okay. We're going to start with this, uh, these little fat jars first. We have these little shaker bits here. Just little shaker bits and shapes of trees and um, flowers, little whales, uh, stockings, elephants, just all kinds of little things. We're going to put some in here. Some won't fit. Oh, they're all stacking. I didn't want them to stack. I want them to go every which way. Just kind of fitting them in and manipulating them to the way I want them to go. There we go, there's one. Put those little shaker pieces in it.
Now we need to pick, need to pick a, a font, a sticker. I think these will look nice. We're going to go with these. So we're going to take the H, capital H, peel it off, and stick it on a jar. H. Do a small O. Small P. The P is going to have to be cut off because it's too long for the bottle. That's okay. And E. I put E on P. And then we have hope. H O P E, hope. Okay? Then need the glue gun. The silver leafing pen. I think the stick silver. Now we'll go on to the little bottles. And since I already filled them up, we're just going to write the word joy on them. We're going to use these itty bitty tiny little ones. And with this we're going to use the tweezers. Our joy. Okay, now we're going to take our hot glue gun. We're going to put three little dots of glue in the middle of this craft stick. This. And we're going to put J O. And there we have it. Joy. You can cut the stick down if you want. And uh,
make it more than a little bottle fell off. That's it. So there's that one done. Okay, is this dry yet? Yeah, it's dry. Okay. We're going to glue on our bottles. One, two, three, four. H O P E. There you have hope. This needs to be turned a little bit. There we go. Hope. H O P E. Hope. Again, you can cut the stick down if you want. I'm not going to cut the stick down on this one. You can make several of them and stack them. Make, make, stack them on top of each other. Faith. We'll do faith first. We'll uncork these bottles. Uncork them one at a time so you don't lose the cork. We're going to stick these, um, Coils down in here as best we can.
sorry, I, you guys, I can't do this on my desk. It's making the biggest mess in the world. I would not suggest using my powder because, as you can see, it's the biggest mess in the world. I would not suggest this, period. It, it's the biggest mess in the frigid world. It's just, mica powder is just a bad idea. Stick with the glitters, people. I did manage to get bottle filled. It's pretty, but it is a mess and a half. I have to do it right over the trash can. I've already got this all over my mouse pad. Man, talk about a mess. Man sakes alive. Lesson learned. No mica powders. Okay, we're going to take these letters here. And we're going to spell out the word faith. If you were to stack them, it would look something like this. So. On to the last one. This is peace. I'm going to put the stickers on first this time. P. See how the sand's gonna go. I don't think the sand's gonna go very well because it's so damp. I don't think the sand's gonna work at all.
have it. There you have them. There you have them all, folks. Peace, hope, faith, love, and joy. And you can have them say anything. You can have them say a child's name. You can have them say um, your spouse's name. You can have them say happy birthday. You can have them say happy anniversary. You can have them say a holiday, Easter, Thanksgiving, Christmas. You can have them say anything. You can have it say a phrase, I love you. You can have it say um anything and you can have these little bottles have anything in them you can put um water in them make them into little snow globes put some uh glycerin and um uh water and that way it'll suspend a little bit with the glitter in it instead of just running all over the place you put a little glycerin in the water and it'll suspend the glitter in the globe a little bit better and it'll uh, appear that it's floating like a real snow globe and that would be great you can do that make little snow globes out of them do lots of different things So that was the tutorial for today, folks, making little message bottles. And I hope it inspired you to make your own message bottle for someone that you care about or for decoration on your mantle or in your Cheerio cabinet or whatever. And I hope it, you find joy in your crafting today. Thank you for stopping by my channel and spending some time with me today. I appreciate you and I love each and every one of you. Thank you for coming. Y'all have a great day. Take care of yourselves. Catch you on the flip side.